this National Dialogue Committee mandate, it seems to be gravely confused uh, with uh, and, and intertwined with a seemingly an issue that appears like a referendum in the making. However, the mandate of uh, the, that special National Dialogue Committee, it has been, you know, completely mismanaged. And what is happening right now is that this committee that was originally intended to bring together His Excellency the President or create a formality where a handshake can take shape between His Excellency President, uh, our President, and the Right Honorable Raila Odinga has turned itself into a referendum preparing committee without doing the necessary public participation that, are, that is required. And we've seen people giving their opinion uh, to the committee in regards to what they expect to see. And that is in violation of the Constitution because if the process of constitutional amendment is going to take shape, then a thorough public participation within the environment where our populations are, whether the units are going to be at the constituency or the county level needed to take shape, I would like to caution the shape it's taking because both in the in Parliament, the National Assembly and the Senate, the issue of extending their mandate has been discussed, saying that they are, they are, they are supposed to pick more opinion on that issue and based on the opinion that is being shared with them, it has turned itself for, to a committee that is preparing for a referendum. As the people of Mandera feel that that is going to violate the constitutional right of the population if it is inappropriately managed. And as such, we like to request His Excellency the President to make clear the mandate of this National Dialogue Committee and the involvement so that the people who are supposed to benefit from it can benefit if the mandate goes beyond reconciling the President and uh, the Right Honorable Raila Amolo Odinga to a process of constitutional amendment taking shape so that we are able to entrench uh, the issues of concern to the people of Mandera.